Hey, it's Candace, and you guys often ask me, how do I confirm if I've sent my customer an email inside? Is there a report I can run? And as of right now, the desktop version does not have a report you can print, but there are a couple workarounds. So first, if you go inside the customer center and you find your customer, if you go over here to send emails, you can see any emails you send, as well as if you go under the transactions and you open it up and over to the right, if you go under transactions, it will let you know right here, last emailed on right there. Okay. So another option you can do is under edit preferences, depending on how you have it set up, you can go under send forms. And then to the right, if you click on company preferences, you can actually add up line carbon copy, which will email it to you as well. So you can make sure that they're receiving it. That's one option. Depending on how you have your preferences set up, if you're using webmail or outlook, you can actually look in your sent folder. And what it will look like when you set up the blind carbon copies, when you go to click to email them the invoice, you'll see the blind carbon copy here. You can have it set up automatically by doing that preferences, or you can, if you don't have it set up, you can actually just click right here, blind carbon copy and put in the email. Or if you have multiple email addresses to do, you can put in the semicolon and put in multiple e email addresses as well, or use the carbon copy. All those are features. So I hope this helps you guys kind of go and figure out which emails you've sent or not sent. And if you are using the QuickBooks online version, there is a way to actually run a report, go up to the I or down below, and I will link that video for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. If you need help with QuickBooks, feel free to check out Confidence with QuickBooks, my online course that takes you from the beginning to the end. If you're a brand new user or you've been trying to figure out QuickBooks, but you've really been struggling trying to do it on your own, the course does come with support. So you can ask me questions and I answer them inside of the course as well as if you enjoyed this tip and you'd like to receive them in your inbox, feel free to go up above or down below and join with your email and I'll send them directly to you. And if you need help cleaning up your QuickBooks or fixing something and you want more of a private session, you don't need the full course, feel free to check out up above or down below. I'll have a link for my private sessions. Have an amazing day. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next tip. Bye-bye.